Elvis Presley died today. He was found at his home in Memphis, not breathing. His doctor pronounced him dead at 3 o'clock this afternoon. The Jimi Hendrix experience is over. The acid rock musician died today in a London hospital, apparently from an overdose of drugs. Former Beatle John Lennon, who was 40, was shot and killed last night outside his luxury apartment in New York. Singer Marvin Gaye was shot to death last Sunday on the eve of his 45th birthday. His father, Marvin Gaye Sr., was booked on suspicion of murder in order to undergo psychiatric tests. Freddie Mercury, the flamboyant frontman of the veteran British band Queen, died Sunday in his West London mansion. His death came just one day after he issued a statement to the press confirming that he had AIDS. We have some sad news to report to you this morning. Frank Sinatra has died of a heart attack. The American soul singer Barry White has died at the age of 58. Rock band Nirvana was found dead in his Seattle, Washington home today. And he said Kurt Cobain apparently shot himself, leaving a suicide note behind. Controversial rapper and actor Tupac Shakur has died in a Las Vegas hospital of complications from several bullet wounds sustained Saturday night, September 7th. Wallace, also known as Biggie Smalls, was killed in Los Angeles in a hail of gunfire. Selena was shot in the back by her own fan club president. Her murder sent shockwaves throughout the world. Have a dream. Don't let anybody take it away. And you always believe that the impossible is always possible. TLC band member Lisa Left Eye Lopez was killed last night in a car crash in Central America. This is so hard because it's such a reality check because it's only two of us up here. <laughs> and she's so missed. A major loss in the music world tonight, the gifted singer Amy Winehouse found dead in her London home. She was just 27. Singer and actress Aaliyah was killed last night in the Bahamas. Their small Cessna crashed just after takeoff. It's hard to say what I want my legacy to be, you know, what I want people to say when I'm long gone. At this point, right now, I'm going to say that I want people to see me as an entertainer, someone who can do it all, and a good person. Singer Whitney Houston, one of the greatest voices of our generation, Grammy-winning entertainer, 48 years old, has died. Former king of pop, Michael Jackson, has died.